Hello everyone. Welcome back in today's tutorial. In today's tutorial we are going to see how to set user preference for Unix tutorial or Unix terminal. So let's start today's session. So first we'll go to the terminal. And now you can see there are some options we can see. The first is at the top you can see the terminal name. Also we can see the color of this font, uh, the font of this letter is something uh, different also the color is blue then we can see the cursor which is like block kind of cursor so these are the few setting even the screen or uh, the background color of the screen is little gray so these are the few things we can modify if you like to so you know how to do that so first we'll see how to change this name so in order to change this name of your screen go to this uh, terminal tab and set title so you can set here you can give any name there is no restriction I'll give the name of this screen is unique screen click ok as soon as you click ok you can see the screen color has changed uh, the screen name it changed now let's try to change the color of this font also color of the background in order to change the color of font and background you have to go to the edit and go to the profile preferences in profile preferences you will see the various tabs first is general second is command then we have colors scrolling and compatibility so in general you can see the profile name you can name it anything then profile id initial terminal size you can change the size for example when you open the new terminal using this terminal it will by default create some size how to change this size in order to change that you can just suppose this is columns 80 so instead of 80 let's make 100 and instead of 24 let's make rows as a 30 and when you close it and if you try to open at that time you will be able to realize you will be able to see the size has changed now again if you want to reduce or increase the size let me show you let's make 120 and again if you open the size will be different now you can see the bigger one so that is the way of showing the size of the terminal now the terminal uh, the cursor shape is block right now if you see the cursor shape is block if you want to change to I beam you can do like just one I beam if you want to change to underline the cursor will become underline so the way you want you can choose that let's select as a block you can change later on also the text appearance allow bold wrap on resize or custom font if you want to custom sub font for example if you want to choose like this and click select the font will change if you want to change something else for example you want something bold kind of thing just choose that and select so it will become bold so similarly you can change the particular type of font let me go back and select the normal one and click ok so you can see accordingly also so there is one more thing you can change the size also like right now it is 12 if you want to increase it you can increase it let me choose this one and let's see how it looks now it looks like this so you can choose anything then we have the command section the terminal then we have colors so right now the text color is yellow if you change to green and select it the color will get changed if you want to change the background color to different something like black it will change the color of background so these are the various things are available from the palette if you select a different color like X terminal or something else you can have those colors so let me cancel this then scrolling options or, or if you want to use default theme you can use the default theme also 
so default is black and the gray background if you want to use any custom skin you can unselect it and you can use this custom green on black you can select or you can if you want to select black on white so what means these are at available if you want to add any custom then you can use a custom color also like color suppose i want green and background as a black so let's choose that select it and scrolling option the scroll uh, we can see this scroll bar scroll on output scroll on keystroke limit scroll then uh, fix scroll speed these are the options we have compatibility so if you want to use any different encoding you can just drop down and select encoding but utf8 encoding provide the most of the characters so normally we choose that escape character sequence is this ascii del and the narrow these are the options available so you can choose that and if you close that option so those will be applicable to your screen so these basic things we can apply to your screen so there are other options also available like file open a new terminal open tab create a new profile or close terminal or if you have opened multiple terminals it will close all the terminals using close all terminals uh, in edit option we just saw the profile preference you can choose the preference also and it will have some basic things like general shortcuts profile and encoding so you for each profile you can choose accordingly there is a help section also available if you want to see the more details about this unix terminal if you want to search you have the search section also in the view section we can see the menu bar full screen zoom in zoom out and normal size i hope this tutorial going to help you to present your data in appropriate manner on your screen thank you for watching my video and have a nice time if you have any questions or queries about unix do not forget to mention in the comment section of this video thank you again and have a nice time